Dog Brain! Like a lab rat. The mean freak dad at home is super busy mom. The boy's best friend is a talking dog. That's right. Three extreme jeans and an air breathing shark. Mega action game control is skating in the park. A feral booster bling bling. What do we make of this? Johnny, 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 this is a life of a boy named Johnny Test. use of photonic discharge, and I appreciate the cool decals. I'll give your laser a B plus. Class outside is totally awesome, Professor Slopsink. Yeah, it's a totally perfect day to get graded on our latest projects. I detest warm summery days. They totally make my undies bunch. Hydraulic exoskeleton, familiar but effective, B minus. Jetpack, retro but still stylish, B. What the graviton is this? It's my quantum chilochino machine. Have some. Uh, are you a mega student? No, I'm the coffee guy. But I'm also a part-time genius. <laughs> I'd hardly call a silly coffee blender genius. <laughs> now let's see some truly ingenious inventions, like, um... <laughs> Sorry, Professor, but we needed our brother's help to demonstrate our super cool project. It's a self-wave generating surfboard. It's like surfing without the surf. The perfect invention for summertime fun. There's already too much fun in the world. But it's total genius. A plus. You call that genius? Fools! You haven't begun to grasp the power of my coffee-based technology. Hello, Earth to lowly coffee guy? Don't quit your day job. Uh, I'll try some of your coffee technology. I'll give you all drinks, frozen coffee drinks, for free! <laughs> Can I get whipped cream on that? Uh, maybe I'll save this for later. In those drinks. It looks like they've all come down with a nasty case of the brain freezer! Pork Belly's newest and greatest super villain! <laughs> oh, chill out, brain freezer. There's no need to go all evil on us. No, it is you who will chill out for good! Hey, she was just asking you to be cool. No, you be cool. Forever! <laughs> and now, to steal these inventions for my own, to take over Pork Belly, and then take over the world! Hey, I've got an idea. Run! I mean, Sir! I'm totally getting the hang of this thing. That's right, run! I mean, sir, away! But you haven't heard the last of the Brain Freezer! Oh, yeah! Now head to the girls' lab. Maybe there's something there we can use to stop that crazy coffee guy. Copy that. Look, there's Scoots, the Turbo Action Backpack, the Zip Ray, and the Nacho Cheese Accelerator. Everything we need to melt the Brain Freezer! Next luck, and it'll take a genius to crack this combination. A genius, huh? If it isn't the young test boy, to what do I owe this unwanted intrusion? We need your help. 
There's a new evil genius in Pork Belly, and we've got to stop him. Now try asking me another question. Like, why should I care? We need to know how to de-encrypt a cybernetic silicon gel time lock. Oh, well, why don't you get your beautiful, yet distantly cold sister to do it for you? Oh, because the brain freezer froze her. What? I'll be right there. Oh, darn that transporter! Hang on, my other leg will be here any second. Well, we gotta get into the vault now. I said I'm waiting for my missing leg. Ah, okay. Lead the way. So how do we get it open? A computerized code breaker? A hypohydro power drill? <laughs> I think I have something a little more sophisticated than that. Dynamite. Dynamite. Uh, okay, so I don't. Fire in the hole! <laughs> We totally have enough here to whip Brain Freezer's caffeinated butt. And if we don't, I took the liberty of grabbing this before I left my secret lair. A firecracker? A molecular firecracker, which disintegrates all inorganic matter within its loud yet <laughs> fun popping audio range. How does it work? Oh, here, I'll show you. You could have just told us, you know. Okay, time for plan B. What's plan B? I have no idea. But we've got to find a way to give the Brain Freezer a taste of his own medicine. Wait, that's it! I hate it when he says that. We just force feed the Brain Freezer his own chilachino, which you save for later, and we freeze him! You know, I have been working on something kind of cool and evil back at my lab that just might help. Yeah. Relax, our legs will be here in a second. Yeah, that'll, that'll work. work. Coffee! Get her you nice icy coffee drinks. Get them while they're nice and icy. Hey, who are you? We're the new icy coffee guys. How about the nice mocha latte, you freezer you? Well, wreaking vengeance did leave me parched. But why do we all have a drink? Eh? Okay, boss. Uh... Don't worry, Dookie. These are non-freezing coffees. Cinnamon. I want cinnamon. <gasps> Uh, um, I'm lactose intolerant. Take this one. But his has sprinkles, so I want this one. Uh, I licked that cup already. Uh, how about this one? Uh, this one. Uh, this one. This one. Uh, what, about this one? <laughs> what about this one? What about this one? <laughs> Try that. I lost track, but I didn't. Okay, great. Drink up, boss. Ha! In your face! You're totally brain frozen. Am I really? Oops, uh, I'm a goner. Time for you to join your sisters and your hairy friend on ice! No one freezes my sweet Susan or Johnny because, well, he's the only one who'll talk to me and understands my complexities. And where were you? I got lost! Anyone for a frozen tree ta <laughs> Get it? tree ta <laughs> ah! Johnny, quickly, give me something cool to say. Tell him coffee is served, but say it tough. Coffee is served. No, oh, no, wait, no. Coffee is served. No, oh, no, oh, that's still not it. How do I say it? Coffee is served. What he said. No. No! And he calls himself a villain. <laughs> Pathetic. We did it! Now all we have to do is unfreeze my sisters and Dookie and the other geniuses. Well, I always find that a nice hot cup of tea can take the chill off. Give it up. I can't believe you guys saved us. Ooh. What are you doing? The only reward that I require is a smooch from my sweet Susan. No way. True, I have newfound respect for you, but my kisses are not for sale! Don't I get any reward for saving all your lives? I can think of one. <laughs> Woo! -hoo! 
Bongo! <laughs> but uh, uh, how, how do you scare this thing? Lean left! No, your other left! Let's go get some coffee. Hot! Hot coffee! <laughs> Hello, snowstorm, and goodbye, school day. Woo uh oh. Hey, the weatherman said massive snow and massive school closings. And now I say it looks like it's off to school, kids. That massive snowstorm I predicted passed north of Pork Belly and instead headed our way is an extreme heat wave. <laughs> heat wave? It's winter. I'm sure you'll get that one wrong, just like you got the snowstorm wrong. And a heat wave is a great time to enjoy the cool taste of red gush. Feel the crush of the gush. Protective snow gear. So hot. It's winter time, and I should be snowboarding and not having to do a ton of homework. What are you gonna do? It's not like you can magically make it snow. Hey, guys. No, but my sisters can. Ah! Ah! It is I, Zidzrar, king of them all, people. We are here to invade the Earth, and we cannot be stopped thanks to our special sunblocker bowl glasses. Now with rhinestones. Now prepare to be invaded! Cool sunglasses, let me see. Bright light, retreat, retreat! Dookie, don't I have the smartest and most beautiful sisters in the world? Yes, you do, Johnny. In fact, I think they're... The answer is no. Why are you saying no? We haven't even asked for anything. You're right, we shouldn't be so quick to judge. Thanks for the compliment. Have a nice day. Well, I guess there's only one thing to do. Please, 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 please. Will you make it snow? No. And all the begging in the world, Johnny, will not get us to shoot water vapor into the air to shift atmospheric patterns in order to create snow and pork belly. Got it? Hmm. Fear not, my friend, who puts food in my belly and scratches me behind my ears, because they've put a challenge on the table, and I am the king of begging. Please, 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 please. No! Please, 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 please! No! Please, 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 please! No! Please, 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 please! Okay, okay, we'll give you one snowstorm. Just please, please, no more begging. Behold, the instant snow-making machine. Snow! It's gonna take a while for the snow to get here, Johnny. Johnny! Eventually, they will get tired and fall asleep. <laughs> it's snowing! All right! No school! <laughs> We have returned to invade the Earth! <laughs> With new protective sunglasses that cannot be removed! <laughs> Retreat! Again! Man, that was one awesome snow day! I gotta have another. Forget it, Johnny. There's no way Susan and Mary will let you use the snow machine again. You're right. So we won't ask them. <laughs> hey, isn't that Gil looking up here and waving? Gil, next door. <laughs> or was that my perfect snow Gil? Snow days roll. Well, that is the last time we fall for the old snow Gil trick. Definitely. But it is a great likeness. Ah, Snowgill!
Looks like Pork Belly got hit with another freaky wave of unpredicted snow, and the kids are enjoying themselves by leisurely sled riding. <laughs> we have returned again. Okay, I need just one more snow day, and then it's back to school, and then I'll do all my homework. Yeah, but there's absolutely no way Susan and Mary will fall for the old snow guilt trick again. Hey, isn't that Gil waving again? What's he doing? Taking off his shirt and flexing his muscles? Whoa, check out those abs. Johnny Test, this is the last time you will make it snow. If you say so. Johnny, how many times did you hit that button? I don't know, why? We are now in day 30 of the freaky Pork Belly Marathon snowstorm. Okay, the bad news is we've been trapped in our house for like a month. But the good news is I still don't have to do my homework. Dinner time! All right, I'm starving! Here you go, kids. Coat loaf! Since Pork Belly ran out of food last week, tonight we're eating my leather coat. Enjoy! Coat loaf? Who'd want to eat this? Can you pass the ketchup? I'm a growing boy. I need protein that's not from a coat. There's got to be something out there! Okay, I'm sorry for overblasting the snowstormer, but can't you fire something up in the air to stop it? We would, but the roof to the lab is frozen shut. And your little snowstorms have left all of Pork Belly without power. The only thing that could stop it would be a heat source strong enough to melt the snow. But what? Hmm. Uh -huh. Well, if we can't go up to melt the snow, then maybe we can go down to the Earth Dozer! Finally! It is our time to invade the Earth! <laughs> and with our sunglasses that don't come off, and with pork belly under 20 feet of snow, nothing can stop us now! Nothing! <laughs> All right, we give up. You win once again, flaming headed Earth boy. Yeah, whatever. Can you guys help us out? You want our help? We were thinking since you control the Earth's underground, can you somehow release the heat from the Earth's center to melt all the snow in Pork Belly? We'll owe you one. <laughs> what could you possibly have that we could want? He could help us with the plans. What? Then forget it. We will not help you take over our world. <laughs> take over you. <laughs> oh, take over you. That's funny. We have better things to do than take over your world. Then what do you want? <laughs> we just want to invade the surface to get some red gush for our fiesta. Deal. Soldiers, open the thermal tunnel. Hey, so where will all the snow go when it melts? Oh, that's a good question. Where will all the melted snow go? Oh, I know! It'll flow down the mole holes and... Uh-oh. Now I need a favor from you. Well, now that all the snow is finally melted away, people no longer have to eat coat loaf. And kids, you better get that homework done, because tomorrow it's back to school. Hey, yes, stop! Can you keep it down? I've got homework to do. Well, we could, but this is my favorite song! Come on, it's a fiesta! Yeah! Well, should have seen this coming.